Hello and welcome to another video of, as I seen, not BP survival but PP survival. So welcome to the PP survival. It's actually BP survival, but you know my pronunciation is kind of bad. So yeah. Anyways, let's begin. So looks like after all this time, it has finally paid off, as you can see. The mobs are spawning in, I'm still finishing this platform, but I'm already getting swarmed by magma cubes, wither skeletons, blazes, all the good stuff. As you can see, there's one skeleton, like, at one point before I moved here, there were more than one skeletons. So yeah, looks like my idea is working, because whole nether fortress is covered in stone slabs. Also, one thing I realized that I haven't done before, so as you can see, my game changes pretty quickly. Well, OBS glitched out there, but uh, I didn't have a video settings full screen resolution to set to current, so my game was like when you press F17, it would take some time, but now it's just like bim bam. In a second, it switches in full screen, window mode, full screen, window mode, like it's fast. So, yeah. I'm learning stuff, and I guess I'm improving my English, and in the next video, or maybe this one, I would like to try one segment where I record without the noise suppression from OBS, which means you would hear computer fan. But now, why would I do want that? Well, I just simply want to test out if I can record better audio without the noise suppression, which obviously... 100% I can. And then, if that's the case, I'll somehow work on silencing my PC. Like, I don't know if I can do much about it, but hey, I'll try. You know, there's fun stuff, so I have excavated this part of the, you know, tunnel. And then I come here and check. And who do you think filled it in? So, yeah. I filled it in because I was working here, but, 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 this guy, this enderman excavated and filled this whole tunnel with grass from the side of the walls and I don't know where did he get all those grass, but somehow they did it, like, I was like, who was trolling me? And then it's just the game. So anyways, you've seen what the Enderman did down there, and we are going to do... Um, I don't know what we are going to do, let's see, let's explore a tower a little bit, so... To see what people are building, you know... Again, this, was, uh, this is my house, this is my factory, this is my stable, the guy's house... The building is going up here, and looks like they imported Panda from Asia. Okay, nice. And looks like there's a wall of slime farm machines. Nice, nice. Nothing interesting as of right now. Oops, skeleton. We don't want to fight it because, you know. Okay, yeah. They do explode and they sometimes destroy the items, not always. And you have a fox there. Um, hmm. So yeah, anyways, if anyone is wondering, I started this storage system and when it comes to me, the storage system is just, you know, chests and basically it's that that. There's nothing interesting, like this will be whole chest, like at least till here. I don't know, I'm not good at building automations in Minecraft. Well, not at least in normal Minecraft, maybe in modded, yes, but in normal, nah. Well, you people really like stalking me, so first was the Gaido guy, and now the Billy boy. I don't know, I guess I'm famous on the server right now, eh? Anyways, I'm just doing cleaning up my chest, so nothing interesting, I'm skipping most of it. But yeah, I just noticed them stalking me. I guess they're interested in what I'm doing. It's not like they're gonna see on the video. Well, it's not like you're gonna see on the video because I guess you people are watching this video. Who knows? Let's continue. And done. Well, now it's done. 
So now I generally know what item is where, so I guess we can go and work on slime fun stuff. Finally. Or, I don't know, let's go do anything. Well, I wanted to go kill the boss, but looks like those two guys already killed him, so... Hooray. I mean, you know, I'm admin, I could spawn one, but I won't. Why? Well, simple, because, you know, we like to play fair on this server, so... All, including me, doesn't have permission to spawn, like... I mean, I have permission, but you know, I won't. So we started working on the machines and we need to we need to um hold on we need to label them so grindstone is like this uh I guess it needs to be normal fence so let's get ourselves a normal fence. Do we have a normal fence? We should have, yeah. Okay. And tada, we made a grindstone. So label it grindstone. Okay. Um, hmm. So that's grindstone. Armor forge. Okay, we don't have armor forge. Uh, ore crusher. Yeah, that's ore crusher. Ore crusher. Oh, okay, no, no, no. And how is it called? Ore crusher and compressor. So compressor, correct. Ta-da! We have our slime fire machines labeled. So you might be wondering, what's next? What's next? It's amazing watching of smelting of iron. I don't know if that sentence made sense, but okay. And if you are wondering, or if you seen, or if you noticed, whatever, uh, I'm trying to pay the I'm trying to be a bit more energetic. I don't know how will that turn out, but you know, you never know until you try, right? Right. It looks like the gang is betting the gang is getting back on. So each day we have more and more more players, which is actually good because you know that's what I want to see because I developed the server for myself to have fun but for others to have fun too, so yeah, it's a win-win situation. So anyways, what, I, what I'm trying to do is create the, 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 how do you call it, the armor forge or this, yeah, armor forge. So we need anvil, which we have, and we need a lot of bows. Now, where did I put string? Oh, that's chain, okay, that, that doesn't go there, that goes in, that just plays chain. Okay, you can't place chain, which is good. That goes into slime fan chest, which is labeled with chrom chromite chunk. I even learned how to make dispensers by myself, so I guess that's something I'm learning Minecraft. And bam, armor forge. I just realized, so what I wanted to make is smeltery, but for smeltery, it's different. Yeah, I need that rack. So, what exactly was I trying to do here? I don't know. It's actually a pretty interesting contraption that doesn't make any sense. Let me just fix that quickly. And voila. Bam. No, no, no. Wrong. Bam, bam, and bam. And just like that, we got... Yeah, we got smeltery. Amazing. So I was thinking, how should I do this so I don't fall down here? Obviously, fans wouldn't work. So I just put this and now I can light up and don't fall down. Amazing. So I'm just gonna put an item frame there. So, you know, we have our flint and steel ready when we need it. And... Well, I guess you learn something new every day. You... you what? You can't place... Hold on. I see. So you can't place item frames above the fences. So I guess I can place it here. And can I use this? Wait, hold on. Yep, I can still use it. So the flint will stay here, I guess. Which is kind of weird. Or maybe... There. Yeah. Better place. 
And I just realized there's makeshift smeltery and smeltery. So, what is the difference? Let's find out. Well, whoever made this addition to my skeleton farm, thank you. It's really useful for collecting, you know, skeleton drops. Anyways, let's see, what is this makeshift smeltery? So, hmm, come on. Eh, oh, hold on, what? Improvised version of the smeltery that only allows you to smell the dust into ingots. Oh, okay, okay, that makes sense. Automatic ignition chamber. What the hell is that? Sometimes things I'm watching on the internet that... Well, while I'm waiting for skeletons to spawn... Holy hell! Like... I'll share the video with you. Because, it, okay, it's not that ugly video, like it's just something you don't see every day, so hold on. So you're used to seeing this screen, but anyways... Uh, look at this. Catching predators on Omegle compilation. Okay, this Uma guy, he's really good at it. And honestly, I love watching it, but holy hell, sometimes I'm so creeped out by it. It's just like, oh, look at this guy. Look, that's like the opposite. how could you ever... Oh my god. Please god, please god, uh, uh, I ask you every day to not become uh, like one of those guys one day because I'd rather take a shotgun to head than become those guys. So anyways, I hope you enjoy those cleansing of your eyes and let's go get XP. Taram pam 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 param pam param pam param Ah, people here on this world are ugly. And I don't mean you guys watching, you know. Ugly personalities. Oh, how, you know, I just can't wrap around my head how people can do that. Like, how can you... Ah. Eh. <laughs> Let's continue grinding. Like, logic doesn't compute here. You know, I must interfere you one more time. This could be someone's grandma. I mean, grandma. Grandpa. And you would never know. Like, ha, ah, holy hell. Well, good thing my, uh, never mind. I don't have grandmas, grandpas, you know. So that's out of options. But imagine this being your grandpa and you don't know he's doing this on yeah, the internet. You are very pretty. Chatting with the I'm young. Also, you're hot, you got beautiful eyes. Hot. Yeah. You're not too bad looking yourself. Yeah, my back. Oh, you are so beautiful. Yeah, let's watch this. May I see your bra? Should I talk about 15 euros, man? I see your bra. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> boy. That's what you get. And I wish those people would come out more because this world has become so like. Actually, it was always. Excuse me. Fucked up. But, but, but. Since the internet, you can see it's actually you know. Excuse me again. Let's continue with Minecraft. This was just a side topic I wanted to share because, you know, everyone has to do or everyone has to have some kind of things they share off screen or their own style. So this will be my style, what I'm watching while I'm grinding Minecraft. Voila. So I've been unlocking the recipes, <laughs> the recipes, the recipe, whatever. Go away car. Anyways. The ancient spirit whispers mysterious words into your ear. Oh, that's basically for any new recipe you unlock. So anyways, we unlocked automatic ignition chamber, prevent the smeltery from using up a fire. Ooh, that was fast. Just fill it up with the flint and steel and place it adjacent to the smeltery dispenser, okay? And we need circuit board, which we don't have unlocked. Amazing. And we unlock pressure chamber, which is built like that, and compresses items even further. Okay, so I guess that's upgraded compressor. So basically, you know, there's like... Oh, welcome back. You know, there's like upgraded version of machines, I guess. Carbon chunk, gravel carbonado, carbonado, black diamond, and synthetic diamond. Okay, so you can create diamonds with carbon chunks. Okay, compressed carbon. 
Oh, that's interesting. You can make synthetic diamonds if you don't want to buy them or mine them. Let's continue. You know, this is actually what Minecraft could use, like, okay, not magic workbench, but ore washer. Well, not ore washer, but as you can see, washer sifted ore to filter ores and give you small stone chunks. So I guess it gives you stone and ores from the gravel, whatever, I don't care. But this is really car, really. So in the smallest street in the whole town, someone is drying like wop 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 wop. Never mind. Anyway, stable. So this is what should be in the basic micro version. Allows you to get eight planks from one log, which is actually pretty amazing. And block of iron, smooth stone slab, and stone cutter. We could make that. But let's continue grinding and see what other items do. All right, wrong button. Okay, now we are talking, look at this, industrial miner, so we are getting in the range of amazing items. Well, the items that cost a lot of levels. So this mod block will mine any ores in 7x7 area underneath it. Place coal or similar in its chests to fuel these machines, so I guess... Yeah, I'm really interested in how this works, so let's go create the industrial miner. I actually like that this uh, plugin also shows the basic Minecraft uh, recipes because I never crafted Blast Furnace, nor do I know what the Blast Furnace, so I guess let's get crafting and see you guys when I have items and when we're gonna start building this. So today I found out how do you make those blocks. I didn't know you have to smell them, but those are the blocks I wanted for the floor of the factory, so I might just rip place them because having clay around is annoying and having efficiency 5 shovel does just this just destroys everything so you know maybe in future i just replace the clay with smooth stone and bam we got blast furnace what else we need we need two pistons well two iron blocks we have two iron blocks we have blast furnace we need chest and two pistons okay let's get to work you see, one would think that I know how do you make pistons, and I do. I still remember. Okay, we got all the items we need, we have coal, and let's go test this out somewhere. Hmm, it mines 7 by 7 so that's like this huge. Maybe I could try it over here. Let's see. And voila, we got... What? Okay, I ran out of the fuel, let's see. Uh... Okay... Hold on, hold on, it's mining ores? Hmm, so this can fuel itself. But you see, how do I know how many ores are there? Okay, it actually mined coal, so... It can actually fuel itself if you get, you know... Coal chunk, as you can see. Interesting machine, honestly. Interesting machine. Well, if you haven't know, if you didn't know what this machine do, now you do. And I recommend you build it too. Because what you can do is go around the world, create 7x7 seven seven areas, so that's like this huge, so one block up, and just place it in the middle, and it will mine out the area of blocks, and it found diamonds. Oh! Oh, and actually, especially now, when the Minecraft is way deeper, you can get way more items from just one chunk. Like, it's not even a chunk, chunk is like 16x16. 16 16. Okay, so it finished and it gave 73 ores. Amazing. I'm actually interested how the automated planning machine actually works. So it's just cauldron and any trapdoor. So 
cauldron is made like so and any trapdoor is made like so so right ah okay so maybe dirt mm, no maybe gravel if we have gravel like i don't know what it supports but yeah we have gravel so let me see okay interesting oh and it gave me sifted ore and what do i do with sifted ore now hmm we hmm yeah <laughs> okay let's try again so i'm not sure what i'm doing maybe i smelt it no okay another sifted ore Yeah, I'm kind of not sure. So what is that? Flint. Okay, that's just normal Minecraft stuff. But what do I do with sifted ore? Okay, 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 okay. Let's see. Let's let's try searching sifted ore. And I guess we need to go to official Wikipedia of slime farm. So let's go there. And you know I won't leave you in the black, so let's see together what does this do. So sifted ore is your most basic resource that can be turned into various dusts. Okay, processing. We need... You can turn your sifted ore into dust with the ore washer or in electric dust washer. So we need to get ore washer. Okay, let's go on it. Okay, okay, it's pretty simple recipe, similar to last one, so dispenser, it doesn't... Oh, actually, we have dispenser, do we have fence? I think we have fence. Uh, let me see. I remember I had fence before. Yeah, exactly too, like... Okay, cauldron and dispenser. Uh, right, cauldron. My brain had a blackout, so... This, this, right? and the dispenser on top and we play sifted ore oh gold dust and stone chunk actually that's pretty good way to get the gold dust tin dust silver dust hold on hold on that's a lot of stuff we're getting that i'm not familiar with but the gold dust is what we had to exchange had to exchange few episodes back so well, that's one way to get the gold dust. I'm actually now interested. What else can I do? What can I do with stone chunk? Let me see. So go back. Stone. Chunk. Okay. Okay, I get it like that. But let's go to Wikipedia once again. Well, that's one big dead end. Those items don't have special properties on their own, so underneath you'll find a list of items to craft them, check this recipe in Slime Fun Guide. Well, what do we need? Stone chunk. So, looks like it does nothing. Hmm, let's try crafting stone with maybe 9 stone chunks can create 1 stone. I mean, that would make sense, or 4 pieces of stone chunks. Let's see. Okay, actually I didn't know you could, you know, place more than one piece of gravel. Hold on, hold on. Let me just show you if I can buy gravel in my own shop. So, um, yeah. As you can see, you can place more pieces of gravel and it will just work on them like that. Hell yeah, it's like a loot box. So, you don't nugget. Okay, let's do this. Okay, machine is full. Holy hell, how many items we got. But we don't care about those items. This is what we care. I don't know why do I care about stone trunk that is useless. Well, I guess you can place it at the decoration if all else failed. So yeah, I guess you can get decoration blocks in terms that looks like stone. So yeah, I don't know. Uh, decorating, yay. You know what? Actually, actually, that's that. That's it for today's episode. Thank you guys for watching. 
like share subscribe do what you do best and see you guys next time bye